Hey, David Breslow back here with you for today's training video tip. Today I want to talk to you about putting. Putting is such a huge part of the game and it's such a huge part of the game where a lot of people have trouble. Putting, obviously, very, very important. As they say, drive for dough, putt for show, an old time phrase for sure. But if you want to cut down those scores on your scorecard, obviously you want to be cutting down the number of putts you hit per round. But here's something I see a lot of amateur golfers getting stuck in. When I do workshops, I do live presentations for golf organizations and golf clubs across the country, uh, we often go out on the golf course after I do a little bit of a lecture for about an hour, hour and a half maybe, talk about some of the wired to win concepts and, and laws and things like that. And then we go out on the golf course and I notice that many of the golfers on the putting green on each hole are very, very tense. So obviously one of the biggest problems for all golf shots is tension. You've probably heard this before, but I don't want to really talk about tension today. I want to talk about this notion and this mindset of thinking about the roll. When you're on the putting green, a lot of times uh, people do what I call stab and jab, which, which means they stand over the ball and their hands and their arms, they kind of move too quick and they kind of just jab at the ball. And the ball never really gets off to a nice, even rolling start. You know golf is a game of rhythm. Think of putting the same way. So when you're standing over the ball on the putting green, I want you to be thinking about rhythm and roll, the two R's rhythm and roll. That's what today's training tip is all about. Because once you get the ball rolling, then you have a much better shot of that ball going where you want. Obviously you need to have the right line and you need to see the line properly, but even if you do that and you don't have the right rhythm and the right roll, that's not going to do you much good. So today's training tip on the putting green, think about rhythm and roll because you want that ball to start moving very easily and very smoothly like this. And in another training video, we'll talk about line as well. But for now, think about rhythm and roll. When you go to the driving range and you're on the practice green, rhythm and roll. When you're out on the course and you're on the green, rhythm and roll. Because if you think about that, because the mind, body, and emotions are connected, and everybody learns this in, in the Wired to Win program, and I have one of the most unique programs on the market today. Uh, it's called Wired to Win, Seven Laws, 21 Days, Change the Way You Think About and Play the Game. We often talk about the mind, body, and emotion connection. Of course we do. That's what the laws are related to. And when you think rhythm and roll, you're putting them back in sync again. And when they're in sync, what I say to every golfer, everything you do, you will do better, including the way you strike the ball on the green. So please, today's tip, rhythm and roll on the putting green. And if you think that first, watch what happens to you. Notice how your body changes, notice how your tension level reduces, and notice how much better that ball is rolling toward its intended target, which is, of course, the cup. So. Dave Breslow here, founder of MentalGolfCoaching.com. Come over there and visit me. And while you're here, please leave me a note. Would love to hear from you and start a dialogue, as always. Would love to get your feedback. So I look forward to hearing from you. Take care and to your best golf.